West Indian Storm, and there it is. And the West Indian fast bowler, Kurt D'Ambrose. 11 without loss, this is Ambrose again. Oh, they've got him, yes, he's out, caught behind. That's a beautiful ball from Ambrose. It bounced, just left him a little bit, went across the left-hander, and nicely taken by Brown. That's the sort of delivery that he bowls so often, and so often gets him wickets. That was a brilliant delivery from Kurt Ambrose, pitching just on that off stump line, and the flower had to play, kept on going across the body, and Courtney Brown doing the rest. That's the start that the West Indies needed in wicket, Zimbabwe 11 for 1. He's gone. Fine catch from Brown, and Ambrose has picked up his second wicket. Talking about Zimbabwe upsetting somebody, but if, it, if they're going to play like that, they won't upset anyone. And on that occasion, we saw the ball coming in uh, to the batsman, and then he was wanting to make room and play down on the offside. It's always difficult to really play a shot like that when the ball's coming into your body, taking the outside edge for a simple catch to wicketkeeper Brown. Evans has gone for 21, it's 91. Slower ball, he's got it away down towards Gurley. Got him, yes he's out. He's got it away, but he's hit it straight down his throat. And that's brought a smile to Ambrose's face. Send the ball down there, he hardly had to move. No trouble at all. And they have been saying all day that Sandra Paul has been doing a very good job in the outfield. And this was a good catch. Slow delivery from Ambrose, pulled around, but Sandra Paul, very agile young man, very good fielder. And a very good catch, comfortably taken.